Hey, and welcome back to the channel. This is your grandpa KC. Today, I'm going to be changing the battery on my Roomba. Now, if your Roomba is, you know, it takes a full charge and it only runs a short time or it won't turn on or or uh, it, it just seems that it keeps showing the battery message, you're just not working at all. It's a good chance that your battery is bad or is failing. And way you know what kind of model number, you'll find right over here by the wheel, the number, and this one is a 692. And the way you take out the battery is you're basically going to need a, a screwdriver. I recommend, like, I use the Wax tools. The main, main, main reason is they're very versatile and they have adjustable torque and they don't cost an arm and a leg. So you'll need to take off your thumper and all of um, these screws that are right here. It doesn't take very much. Now, of course, one of the things that you, of course, want to have done already is to clean the contacts where it makes contact with the base stand, which I've already done. Because these can get a lot of debris on them uh, and prevent a good contact connection. Okay, and then what you're basically going to do once you've done that is lift this little plate off. And that's going to expose the battery. And we can see, here's my lithium battery. And you may want to remove any dirt. If you ever find that these metal mechanisms fail, it's the same procedure to take these out that you're doing here. Now the battery is basically a lift out. You're going to grab it and just lift it right out. And if you look in here, there's four contacts. You can see them. And we're going to just put the new battery in its place. Now, one of the things it was not doing, it was, it was acting up. Now, I did not buy the Roomba battery, which was $89. In fact, I bought an off-market brand, which was rated by, by fake spot as an A. And to, by the way, that is something that... I, I downloaded onto my Amazon and all of those accounts because it kind of checks for false information. Now it will only go one way. So is it going to go this way? Let's see. Just to make sure. And as you can see, just wanted to show you it, you can't make a mistake by putting it back in again this is a replacement I'm gonna put it back in again it makes contact with that this is our old battery which we're going to be checking in a minute now we'll just put the cover back on it also make sure that when you get a replacement battery that it has the same ratings And the old battery is 14.4 volts at 500 milliliter, 500 milliamps. This one is 1800 milliamps. So this is this battery will last longer. And just put the battery cover back on it, and just lightly screw these in and already my uh, Roomba is coming back to life And lastly, but not least, the, the kit does come with a new uh, edger brush. So it's a good idea to change that while you're doing this also. I've already taken the screw out and put it in. There we go. And my room is all ready to be charged. Hey, thanks for watching. This is your grandpa KC again. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. 
I'll leave you the links within the Amazon where you can find this uh, battery for this particular model. It's a, the one for the original manufacturer it was $89 and the one on Amazon was $19 and it is rated at a higher rate. Um, if you haven't done so already, don't, you can load FakeSpot onto your computer. FakeSpot will check with AI the ratings of various products to see whether or not they really are any good. And that's what I use to check all my products. So again, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Leave us a comment. Did you try to change in the battery yourself? Were you successful? And also, I'll leave you the link for all the other parts that you probably might need should you want to do a complete maintenance on your, your unit. Again, check out my other videos. And this is your Grandpa KC. I love you and see you in the next video. So you've been watching Grandpa KC. I hope you enjoyed this video. This is another DIY. It's simple and easy. A grandpa explains it for you to change the battery on your room of 600 and series. I'll list all the different models that you can do this on. Nothing, it's not rocket science. The replacement battery did come with a, a, a bumper kit. This is the little brushes that go on the edges. And it does what it come with a cleaning tool. I'll also leave you a link where you can find the battery. And also other the brushes and other pieces that you might decide to replace, which are part of the maintenance on it. So don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Leave us a comment. Did you try it yourself? Were you able to, were you successful? And did the battery fix the problem that you were having? I'll leave you a link for the next video you can be watching. And we'll be back with the next video. Remember, your grandpa loves you. We'll see you in the next video.